In the past, the idea of featuring myself in a video and posting it publicly was a non-starter. I couldn't wrap my head around my audience or decide where to post my content, but here I am now, lighting up my little corner of the internet. So what changed in the spring of 2020? You already know. When COVID forced a physical barrier between everyone, it created an open space for me, an introverted extrovert, to create on my own terms. Once insulated, my little hamster brain produced an abundance of ways to occupy my time. Using video was the best way to communicate my process and progress. Look, I made a staircase. The truth is, I just really want to build stuff and solve interesting problems. In my case, this means refinishing an antique bathtub or building a retaining wall out of tree stakes and wine barrels. During the spring, I made an effort to present a more authentic version of myself online. I merged my personal interests with my professional profile through my website and social media. Learning how to make videos was a key component. I sent iMovies to my family and friends while experimenting with time-lapse, title overlays, and music. Then I used Adobe Premiere Pro to edit 50 videos into one eight-minute birthday greeting. We are still in the midst of a global pandemic, so creating keeps me grounded and lets me virtually wrap my arms around those in my network. Now, I love sharing projects, especially when I can deep dive into a hobby like beekeeping. Using video storytelling, I'm approaching the next stage in my program management and communications career. I even bought a new camera. Am I trending yet? 